previously on the Hardcore Series. Oh my god. And Gabe. Boom, baby! Gabe, this is very, very, very big for the account. I never thought I actually would do it, but if there was once a day to do it, it was today. And to start it off, Hespri number 40 without a bottomless bucket, boys. Here it is. 35 is a drop rate, and we are going dry on the mossy, and we're going dry on the Hespri. A spirit seed, though, which I can't use. I'm hoping this poll where you can trade in spirit seeds is going to come through soon, because I already have five, and there's not really much I can do with them. Oh, yo! Nunchak on the 42nd. I don't even have that on my clue, boy. Yo, and a Bando Space 4. That might be the full book. If that is, that's actually insane. Um, no, we don't have, but it is, however, the third page. Yo, this is so some beautiful uniqueness. Two uniques. We haven't had a unique in a long, long, long time. So that's pretty big. Oh, yes, dude. Yes, that's the battle axe, baby. I thought it was a sword for... I was like, wait, is that a spear? Oh, it's the battle axe, dude. Fuck yeah. Oh, we're going to Seracnus today, baby. We're going to Seracnus today. Ooh, that is big. I thought the battle axe for some reason was going to be orange or something. Oh, that's... Why am I still using a bow, bro? Why am I still using a bow? Put this thing on crush and let's go. Kuros KC 551. Spoon fed as always. And after the relief blade of battle axe, we hit the sword. <laughs> Not really needed anymore, but I mean, sure. But apparently this is better for this Slayer task. We got it in the complete wrong order, but my god, is it my lucky day today? Are we gonna get the Essence on Only Trails? <laughs> Let's get prepared for our very first boss, KC, on the one and only, my favorite, Seracnus. It's a boss that I really want to be in the high scores for. Top page is only 300 KC, so that should be very, very, very possible. Let's go. And the very first kill is in. There we go. He spawns way faster now, so I gotta be careful a little bit. Number three, the grubby key and an egg sack and 17k. Holy shit, that's so big. That's why I love this boss so much. All right, so we got an elite clue from Sorokness, the fourth elite, I believe. I didn't expect to hit it. This was the easiest elite I've ever done. Only dig clues, not even coordinate. One coordinate and four dig clues, and that was it. All right, let's open it in the middle of Faldor Square. If we get a rune crossbow, then I don't even have to train my fletching, which I'm still going to do, though. If I get third age before my only trails account, I will give away five bonds right now. Absolute junk, as usual. Elite Clue's second worst clue in the game. And there it is, the 50th kill for the high scores. Seracnus, Hardcore Trails, or Mr. Trails RS is now for the Seracnus high scores, baby! I don't know what rank we would be, but the plan is to go top page eventually with this guy, so that is already very, very nice. And after a small afternoon of just fletching, we reached the goal that is the Rune Crossbow. Finally obtained. Let me get my runeite limbs. Rune limbs. That's that. Now, where did I get the uh, string? That's not a bow string. It's, it's uh, in it one of those meat things. I don't fucking know what to do, guys. Come on now. I'm but I'm but a clue boy. What the fuck am I doing, man? Sinu. Use that on a spinning wheel and we should be fine, right? And then, I don't think I've told you guys yet, but... I have a Basilisk Slayer Tusk, which means we're going to do the Basilisk Knights for the first time ever. I think I have about 160 to do. I'll check in a second. That's the room crossbow on the Arco Iron Man. That's what they say, right? And 144 Basilisks to go. It is a 1 in 1,000 drop for the jaw. It would be best in slot for raids melee. And basically best in slot melee, if not on the Slayer Tusk. So that is pretty crazy. Anyway, let's go. Oh my god. <laughs> And there it is, the first Basilisk Knight task done, with the lost skill of the task luck, as always, coming in clutch with that. A loop half of a key, ladies and gentlemen, that is beautiful. All right, never mind. Let's uh, move on to get 82 Slayer and then boost for that whip. That's the plan for this episode. We have three more Scotizo kills because we're on a greater demon task, so let's see if Scotizo is giving us any luck today. Maybe a Dark Claw, maybe a little pet, maybe a Elite Clue. That's an Elite! Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I want. Wait. No, I have a hard clue in the bank! What do you mean? What a waste. Oh, no. Yup. Wilderness Agility Course. Don't do that. And Circle on the Elite. 
this hurts, but we move on. Oh my god, another elite? Holy shit. Back to back. The elite drop is gonna be non-existent. No bop shirts. We gotta drop this one. Oh, it hurts every time. But we already completed four, so I mean... The emote clues are always gonna fuck me up. Is it the casket? It is the casket! Let's instantly open it. No milking. Boom! It's alright. Another elite clue back to back to back? No, but room played bodies are great, though. Two out of three completed. That's not too bad. Let's see what we get. Ooh, hopefully that is one I need. Oh, crap. Can I get out of here? Oh, yeah, I can. Hopefully that is the completion of the Book of Law. If it is, that'd be insane. That's probably the best book I could get. I don't have any range shield slot things right now. Please. Oh, it could be. It could be it. No! We need number four. That's unfortunate. Hey, there we go. We completely missed it, but that is 82 Slayer. Unfortunately, I don't have any cannonballs anymore, so I'm manually killing Calphites, which is actually disgusting. But this is the level that we're going to use to boost for the Abyssal Whip, so let's get to the Abyssal Demons. Boys, let's boost up. What? No, only nine seconds? That was very bad timing on that. But oh well, the first pie is a waste, but we've started killing the Abbey Demons right now. Let's hope to get that whip today. That'll be incredible. Get lucky on the whip, not on the essence, maybe? The very first Abbey Demon kill is coming up. Here we go. 1kc whip, maybe? All these Abbey Demons are tagged. Why? Come on, a very, very early whippy would be incredibly appreciated. So I can speed up my Slayer grind a lot. And we can get the raids ASAP. All right, boys. Hard clue number 45 from the Abbey Demons while we're boosting for that whip. I'd love some alchemals because I'm out of Chaos Runes. I gotta rebuy Chaos Runes and I'm out of money. So please, some alchemals. Only two, but I'll take it. It's not great, though. Yes, there we go. 86 magic. Now we can actually do bl uh, smoke barrage. Make this go a lot quicker. The DPS is going to double right now. We'll see. Can I get some whip spam in the chat real quick again? Some noodle whips. We need it now, baby. We need that noodle whip. Whoa, Carter the RuneScape guy, well... There it is, baby! Spoon-fed whip. 345 KC. I really hoped, and it delivered. Let's go. Considering we still had a monster clue in the bank that needed a full barrow set, with this whip, I decided to go back to barrows. Get in here, if you guys got some barrows to do. Let's get those Gothic's legs. Oh my god, Darok Playbody! I just said Guthix legs instead of Guthans, but oh my god! That's one of the items I don't have on only trails yet. First chest of the day, and that is one of the two items out of 940 chests that I don't have on only trails yet. So let's check the collection log real quick, because we still have a monster clue that we need a full barrows set for. Any full barrows set would do. Oh my god, yo, we only need one more piece from Darok and we got that full set. We only need one more piece from Torag, we only need one more piece from Guthans. But that's what we're going for today. That's actually big. Only one more of three sets. We don't have any Varax pieces yet, though. But my god, first chest of the day, that's insane. Alright, the 200th barrows chest. We're going for Guthans skirt. Darok plate legs or Torag's hammers. Good luck, Spoon. Thank you. Oh my god, my first Varak piece. It's raining Barrows plate bodies today. Wow, the 200th chest. Yo, this account at Barrows is so disgustingly lucky. It's not really what we need, but a new Barrows unique. I'm not gonna say no to it. Called by Flubies Hardcore. Big Spoon. That's a nice thing to have. Yeah, that's the- that's a dupe. That's a dupe. That's unfortunate. I need the skirt or the, what is it? Yeah, the gutten skirt would have been big. That's an annoying dupe. I think that might actually be my third one too. I'm not 100%. I'm probably lying. No, that's my second. Unfortunate. The chaps would have been clutch. Yes, there it is. That's an elite clue. That's what we wanted. That is an absolutely disgusting chest though. A bunch of mind runes. 7,000 GP, but we got an elite clue, so that's good. That's an easy clue that's not bad. I don't think we have many of the Sarah pages, though. Oh, no, never mind. It is a new page. It is a new page, and we got a fashion scape black beret. Look at this guy. Ho, 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 ho. And then the elite clue casket number five. Trash as always, but a crap load of Laurens and 16 summer pies that I use for solo winter, Todd. So it's not too bad. Yeah, that's a dupe. 
That's, uh, unfortunate, because I still need the Torax hammers for a full set. No! Another dupe! Come on, man, there's so much I still need. While this little barrow's grind is going on, 91 hit points, 250 barrow's chests, one-fourth into a thousand, and we still don't have a full set. Now, it's not to be expected that I get a full set at, like, 250, but I had two dupes today. Can we get lucky? No, and it's probably the second worst chest I've had today. I spent a little time herbloring, and now we have 70 herblore getting closer and closer to that raid's goal. Can now clean dwarf weeds, which I have a bunch of my back of, but nothing else, actually. I, uh, not really a very important update, but it's a very nice 70 level, and we're getting closer to that 1800 total level too. 78 herblore, and I'm jumping straight into raids. Doesn't matter what gear I have. All right, this is the very first hard contract. I boosted with a uh, guarded pie, and I'm so excited to see what is in it. You can just buy these from the Varrock uh, cooking guild, by the way, so they're really great. Jane, another hard contract, please, that I can please complete. Catentines, easy. Thank you very much, Jane. Now give me Hesperi seed or heart. Ooh, look at all these herb seeds. That's not bad, even though we're still looking for hardwood tree seeds and Hesperi seeds. Pretty big landmark on the account coming up right now. 50 hard clues. Maybe I am a clue man after all, even on the hardcore, boys. Here we go. We got an easy and a hard clue. The I would love to complete any of my god pages. Now, which ones do we need? We need Gothic's page one, Arma page four, and Ancient page two. I did not remember that, but let's hope. That's a Bandos page. We didn't need any of those, I think, but it's the start of one- oh, man. We've got three pairs of four books. Come on, Heart Clue. I swear, if that is also the third one, I've got every single book. Oh my god, you're kidding me. Wait. Oh no, it did stack up. Never mind. Ah, uh, so many pages, so little books, bro. Oh wait. <gasps> oh, I didn't see that Bando's page. Let's go. We got a book. <laughs> I'm so blind, bro. Our first God book. Very welcome, especially for the monster clue step. Right. We got this clue step in Weiss, and I've been postponing this quest for a very long time. Uh, but I guess we're doing making friends with my arm. We're coming up on the boss fight of making friends with my arm, and I'm scared because you cannot teleport out of this area. Here we go. Teleports are blocked. There's no way to retrieve your items if you die. So I got teleport and I may lose my stuff. Okay. There we go. It's the final blow. Here we go. There's actually a sick amount of herb lore XP at the end of this quest, right? Didn't I need Ukuntaki dung for this quest? Why do I have Ukuntaki dung in my fucking bank when I don't even need it for this quest? I'm excited to see the herb lore XP. None. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why I always think that troll quests give herblore XP, but a good decent amount of agility and uh, mining. Uh, also, 525 quest points. The quest was worth it! We got our sixth elite clue casket in the inventory right now! That is incredible. Let's open it in the Ferox Enclave. That is one of the most disgusting elite clues I've ever seen, but it's 709k. This is the fashion scape for pure accounts, I guess. Oh shit, it's actually only from elites. Okay, that's a unique then. I'm happy. That's my first unique on the elite glue collection log. And there it is. 84 farming on Hespery, and you might be thinking, 84 farming? That's not that impressive. But right under it, you can see why it's such a big deal. One thousand and eight hundred total level 47 more total levels and i am in the top three thousand which is when the hardcore iron man's death twitter will start tweeting out my name if i die all right it is time to challenge the hardcore for the first time actually we're going to god wars we got greater demons we are going to zami 